This show is amazing. It's a very new production for Cirque du Soleil. It's the first time we have a show inspired by a movie. And uh, it's the first time we have an English-speaking storyteller who's helping guide the audience through this journey. And it's a story of three Navi teenagers on their quest to save Pandora. So along the way, they come across different tribes, uh, different creatures, different sceneries. Uh, it all takes place 3,000 years before the events that happen in Avatar. And one of uh, the most exciting things about the show is the technology we're using. So we have 40 projectors that really help bring to life the world of Pandora in an arena setting and make a big arena feel much more intimate. I've had to learn to fly indoor kites, which I had never really been exposed to before. It's pretty incredible. They represent the ikran or the, the banshees. Um, and we have all different uh, sizes, and it's a pretty beautiful scene. So there's kite flying, there's a boomerang specialist as well in the show. Um, we also have contortion, and of course the large scale puppets, which is pretty um, new for Cirque du Soleil, and um, a great highlight. We have viper wolves and dire horses and all these creatures of Pandora that are brought to life by puppeteers. Of course the projections, which as a performer, it's really interesting to integrate live with your environment. You know, flowers come alive in front of you, or you know, we have have one scene where we're climbing a cliff to save Pandora and rocks are falling and you know you're dodging out of the way and stuff like that so it's it makes it very interactive for us as performers. Of course we're targeting our Cirque du Soleil fans and people who have supported us over the last many years but we're also uh, reaching out to a new audience people who are fans of Avatar sci-fi or technology that perhaps haven't uh, experienced a Cirque du Soleil show before, so for sure we have a very interactive website. Um, and we also have an interactive app, mobile app, that we're using in the show um, because nowadays uh, a lot of people are connected to their phones during the show, taking photos and video, and this allows us to create, uh, well, both to capitalize on that and create an even more immersive experience. So at key moments in the show, the app will tell you to lift up your phone and point it at the stage, and it will um, it will allow you to be a part of the effects that are happening.